Welcome to Indian Rocket in Minutes from Motilal Oswal Research Desk. We will be covering technical and derivatives SII's activity, index, actionable sectors and stocks to watch out. So stay tuned till the end. Hey, this is your host Shivangi Sarda and let's look at what happened globally. Market is expected to open on a positive note driven by a rally in the global markets as investors shift their focus to the upcoming US election results and the Fed Reserve's interest rate decision which will be announced later this week. Domestically, the market is technically oversold after a sharp decline in the recent sessions and there may be opportunities for value buying following the US election results, especially given the favorable risk reward ratio. Additionally, the MSCI index review is also scheduled. To start with our first segment for Wednesday, 6th of November 2024, Nifty index opened negative and witnessed swings within a range in the first half of the session. It rallied up in the second half and jumped by almost 400 points from its intraday low levels. The market's recovery in the final hour was largely driven by traders covering short positions ahead of the US election results. It managed to cross 24,200 and close near the same with gains of around 220 points. It formed a bullish candle on the daily frame and broke its lower highs formation of the last three trading sessions. Now, India Wix was down by around 3.5% to 16 zones. Nifty put call ratio increased to 0.94. Both these factors paved way for the bulls to step in. Option data suggests a broader trading range in between 23,700 to 24,700 zones, while immediate range is in between 24,000 to 24,500. Moving on to the second segment in the equity cash market, FIIs were net sellers to the tune of 2,569 crores, while DIIs were buyers worth 3,031 crores. FII's index long short ratio increased to 26.5%. Going ahead with the index actionable, derivatives data and price setup suggest Nifty has to hold above 24,115 for bounce towards 24,300 and 24,450 zones, while supports can be seen at 24,000 and 23,850 zones. Bank Nifty has to hold above 51,750 for a bounce towards 52,750 levels, while support can be seen at 51,500 levels. And finally, talking about the sectors and stocks to watch out, positive setup can be seen in some of the metal names including GSW Steel, NMDC and Nalco. For the banking space, we have SPI, ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank, Federal Bank and CUB looking quite positive. While some weakness could be seen in Berkshire Paint, AU Bank, Citus Life, Adani Ports, Bharti Airtel, MGL Emphasis, Kolpal, Cummins India and Mariko. Wish you a super trading day ahead. Shivangi Sarda signing off. Follow this podcast for solid advice. Investment and securities market are subject to market risk. Read all the related documents carefully before investing.